So I went to the Comic Con in Lisbon, Portugal with the sole purpose of meeting this man. Dolph Lundgren. I saw his face and Nick Holtz on the poster of Comic Con and I thought to myself, oh my god, I needed to get a picture with that guy. So this is the story of me, Invisible Nympho, trying to get a picture with Dolph Lundgren at Comic Con 2018. So me and my girlfriend arrived at Comic Con at around 2 o'clock in the afternoon. Immediately trying to see where we can get a picture with Dolph. It's not advertised on the website and once we were actually there, it wasn't advertised there either. So instead, we start working around the events to see what's to do. <laughs> And right off the bat, I have to say I'm not really part of the gaming community. I don't really read comic books or anime and honestly I don't watch that much manga. I mean, I love Dragon Ball Z and there were some pretty cool posters and toys. Deadpool is kinda cool, I guess. I love both movies. There's some Lego here. Yeah, I played with those as a kid. But yeah, and me and my girlfriend's son. <laughs> And we punched this boxing thing. But honestly, this event was not for me. I just really wanted to meet Dolph Lundgren and Nick Holtz. So one hour passes by and we found out where Dolph Lundgren was. He was giving some speech in a VIP lounge. So we asked staff when the autographs and the photos would start. And they told us that Nick Holt, it was already too late. Which was kind of a bummer, but for Dolph, it was another hour. And we had to pay for it. Uh, yeah, we had to pay extra to add get a photo or autograph of Dolph Lundgren which was also a bummer since again on the website which is entirely in Portuguese it's only mentioned briefly that the photographs need to be paid for but I didn't read the FAQ of the website before buying tickets and I probably should have I just assumed that it was included in the price of the tickets which it wasn't but honestly it does make sense if it was for free then poor Dolph would be there for hours taking pictures with anybody that wanted it or maybe they would limit the people who were able to take pictures to maybe the first 50 people that showed up so whatever I paid 40 bucks <sighs> to take a picture with Dolph Lundgren. I mean, fuck it, right? It's Dolph Lundgren. He was Drago. He was the Punisher. He was in the Expendables. I'm gonna meet him and take a picture with him and it's gonna be fucking awesome. And when I grow up, I wanna be just like him and have his babies. Awkward. Because he's the greatest Swedish stud of all time. Just take my money already, please. Do it. So, after standing in line with other women and grown ass men who were also totally in love with him, it was time for me to meet Dolph Lundgren. So this is how it went. Hi. Hey. Okay, thank you. Yeah. Awkward. That's literally how I met Dolph Lundgren. It took about 5 seconds and for security purposes I had to leave my camera back outside the photo booth because they had their own professional photographer there so I couldn't take my own photos or videotape our interaction which I understand I guess. Dolph is massive. That's what he said. Not just tall but even at 60 years old he's still built like a beast. That's some crazy genetics right there. Apparently staff told me he was kinda sick or injured and he had to take a lot of breaks while taking pictures and signing autographs. And honestly he didn't look too good so I'm assuming that's the reason for our short interaction and also because there were several people behind me so they had to keep this as short as possible. But in the end it was still awesome and I'm glad I put in the effort to make this happen. So now the picture was taken it's time to collect it from the staff of the event. Or was it? <music> 
right after taking the picture, staff kinda ignored me and I didn't know where to get my picture, what to do or even where to exit the venue. Eventually I did ask someone and she simply said, just come back in an hour, the pictures are not yet ready. So okay, I waited an hour outside and then I came back and some pictures were already ready, but not mine and several others as well. So I asked again and said one more time, come back in another hour. I said, you said it an hour ago. Where's my picture? They said, come back tomorrow. I said, what? No, I'm not coming back tomorrow. I only bought a ticket today. So I'm coming back today. Where's my picture? And this was basically the reaction of the staff to me asking why my picture wasn't ready. Doesn't get a picture with Dolph Lundgren. He does. Three and a half hours later, after taking a picture with Dolph Lundgren, my picture still wasn't ready. What? and a dozen other people just like me were freaking out. Uh -oh. The final excuse that they gave us was, was that the files were corrupted and there were no pictures. What? Yeah, the files were corrupted. It took them all afternoon to come up with that. Dude. So people, including myself, got pissed. Uh -oh. Staff finally said, listen, you can get a refund or give us your details and we'll send you a new ticket free of charge to come back tomorrow and take a new picture with Dolph Lundgren. But me, being the cynical prick that I am, told them, you're supposed to have our pictures ready three hours ago and you don't have them. So what if you also forget to send us an email with the tickets so we can come back tomorrow? I got some dirty looks from staff after saying that, but I don't really care, it was a valid point. Screwed up taking a simple picture and just giving it to me. So what's to say you won't screw up sending a simple email? Either way, I gave them my details and me and my girlfriend went home. One hour went by, two hours went by, three, four, five, six motherfucking hours went by after the leaving the event and they never sent a goddamn email with new tickets. So I could come back the next day to take a new picture with Dolph Lundgren. Goddamn fucking idiots. Incompetent, some goddamn fucking bitch, cock sucking, motherfucking, head shoved up your own ass, motherfucking, head shoved up your own ass, cock slapping, fuck, 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 so after sending some angry tweets to them, I eventually did receive an email with free tickets so I can attend the Comic Con again the next day to get another picture with Dolph Lundgren. I traveled back there, got inside, and what do you know? Can I get a drum roll, please? They found my picture. Just look at it. Two studs on top of their game, just being epic. Dolph and I, and yes, we are on a first name basis, are specimens of physical perfection. That's really what this picture is. So yeah, I got my picture with Dolph Landgren and this was basically my story. If you like this video, subscribe to my channel, follow me on Twitter, at Invisible Nympho and also follow me on Instagram that's at Invisible Nympho. I hope to see you in the next video. Bye motherfucking bye. Where is my picture? Where is my picture? Where is my motherfucking picture? Where is my picture? Where is my picture? Give me my motherfucking picture. Scooby the wop pop pop scooby the wop. Where is my fucking picture? Picture!